Hey, welcome back. We are joined on the phone by a couple of guys making music with the Nashville Entertainment Weekly Records. Jason Clark and Matt Barfield are joining us. They're from Mercy Shine, and they've got a self-titled EP that you can check out, and we're going to hear their brand new single, Curves, coming up in just a little bit. But first, let's bring these two guys in. How are you guys doing this morning? Hey, How are you doing? Where, uh, what part of the country are you guys coming to us from? Oh, currently I am in Illinois, and Jason is in North Carolina. Illinois and North Carolina. What's the what's the weather like in those two cities here in the middle of summer? Well, here in Illinois, it's sunny and hot. <laughs> <laughs> same, same thing. Same thing here in North Carolina. Same here in Oklahoma. So we're all in the same boat then. <laughs> we're uh, we're gonna get into some of you guys' uh, music and talk about uh, talk about the new uh, the new single. We're actually gonna hear that coming up in just a little bit. But let's get to know you guys uh, first. Um, Jason, let's start with you. Uh, give us a little bit about your background, where you're from, and, and what part of the country you grew up in. Um, I am from a little town called Ivor, Virginia. It's up around probably about an hour. From Virginia Beach, Virginia, in the Norfolk area. Um, I was born and raised, born in Suffolk, Virginia, and raised in Ivor. And that's where me and Matt met each other. We were like a town over from each other. Okay. So what, how far back it was that when you guys met? How old were you guys whenever you first met, met up with each other? Uh, me and Matt met... When we were around 17 or 18, and that's when we started our first rock band. Nice. Together. Nice. So, Matt, where are you originally from? A uh, little town called Dendron, Virginia, which is in Surrey County. And don't bother looking for it on the map, dude, because you're not going to find it. <laughs> One of those and, towns. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we got plenty of those here in Oklahoma, so I know exactly where you're coming from. Um <laughs> So you guys met up as teenagers and, and, and formed your first band. Uh, what, were there any musical? Uh, was there any musical influences within your family growing up in your home, or did you guys just come about it uh, on your own naturally? Well, my my family, my dad listened to everything across the board, so I kind of inherited my big ear for music from him. And so through him, I got to learn about Elvis, Motown, uh, stuff like Tommy James, the Shondells. And then, of course, into the seventies, you had Kiss, a huge Kiss fan, Led Zeppelin, AC/DC, Aerosmith. And of course, in the eighties, it was Motley Crue, um, Rat, Quiet Riot, Twisted Sister, Judas Priest. The list goes on and on and on. Awesome. That's a that's a pretty large musical. Uh background to draw from so how did you guys go about deciding what kind of music you wanted to play this is funny jason called me one day and asked me if i wanted to record a country song and i said well i want a great rock singer so what makes you think i'm gonna be a great country singer to which jason replied by saying i'm not asking you to be a great country singer i'm just asking if you want to record a song so uh <laughs> We, we went to the studio and recorded it, and uh, Chemo Forrest actually played all the instruments with the exception of the banjo, which was played by Jason Roller. And uh, he also, Chemo also produced it. So I'm, I'm pretty proud of this little EP, man. It's, 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 it's really great. And some people probably are familiar with, with Chemo, but tell us, uh, tell us where, what he does for a living besides produce records. He's, uh, he, he's the guitar player. For the group Alabama, right. He is all. He's also the vocalist and guitar player for Cash Creek. So a little bit of experience in in the business there. Yeah, he's oh, got. Yeah. yeah, he's got a lot there. <laughs> We're talking to Jason Clark and Matt Barfield from Mercy Shine. We're going to hear their new single coming up in uh, just a little bit. You told us a little bit about your musical influences. Uh, did you? Were you guys? Uh, did you find when you started out uh, playing together that you were uh, naturally gifted as musicians, or did you take lessons, or or how did uh, how did that process go? Most. This is Jason. Most of my stuff 
was played. I learned playing by ear. Mm-hmm. Um, that's where I learned most of my stuff and being self-taught. What about you, Matt? With me, it, with, with me, it was just singing along the records. Uh, Queens Wright, Waylon Jennings, Hank Jr. Just anything across the board. So no professional, yeah. no professional uh, learnings. You guys just came about it on your own. Uh, yes, sir. Outstanding. Uh, let's talk about the EP, uh, the self-titled EP. You mentioned uh, a little bit about uh, the the producer of, of the uh, of the EP. Uh, tell us uh, about some of the songs and how you guys brought those songs together to to put this out. I'll let you yeah. handle that one. <laughs> <laughs> the, um, we had, we actually. Matt and myself, we actually write as well, but for this, since we were stepping into a new genre, we reached out to some publishing companies as well as some writers, and they were kind enough to pitch us some songs. I think in total, we were pitched probably 52 to 62 songs, and we narrowed it down to the five that we have on the EP. Okay. So that was a bit of a process, I would imagine, to have to narrow, narrow, call some out and decide which ones you wanted to to, to put down on tape. Yeah, that, yeah, was, that, that, yeah, that was the most tedious part right there. Was trying to figure out what songs we wanted because I, I, I want a little bit of rock thrown in there too, you know. Right. Uh, and I, and I think that we did a really great job, man. We 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 picked out some really great songs, and 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 again, I'm really proud of this EP. I, I just can't say enough about it. So. Well, we're going to get a little taste of it uh, with the new single, Curves. We're going to hear that here in just a second. But first, uh, tell us a little bit about uh, Curves and uh, kind of what we can expect uh, from, from you guys uh, when we hear this. Uh, well, it's an, uh, it's an homage to the country girls around the world. That's probably all that needs to be said, right? <laughs> well, we, all, we, we also would like to say there was also three great songwriters that Absolutely. were kind enough to let us cut the song um jason matthews was one of them joel shoemake and william michael morgan who he is also an artist himself right yeah those are three brand names guys yeah they're they're, they're they're great songwriters man they really are they are all right well let's hear it this is uh mercy shine this is their brand new single it's called curves Looking at the road, looking at you, ten and two, too hard to do. Girl, you're looking so fine, hard to keep this truck between the lines. Feels like 90 miles an hour, feels like I need to take a cold shower. Thank God I'm only doing 30, oh I be reckon now, Lord have mercy. Country girls are like country roads, you wanna hug them tight, you gotta see where they go. Slow down that Chevy Cause they'll both make you swerve Yeah, country girls are like country roads The best ones have got curves The best ones got The best ones have got curves Tank is full, so is the moon Dashboard lights looking good on you What'd you say we flip up the armrest? Whisper to me where you wanna go next Getting dirt but my heart is racing You're looking so amazing I'm taking pictures with my eyes Girl, you're God's gift to leave Country girls are like country roads You wanna hug them tight You gotta see where they go You wanna take in that scenery Slow down that Chevy Cause they'll both Country girls are like country roads The best ones have got curves Baby, you got it, get it Go on and fall it, fall it Don't you know how bad you're making me want it Country girls are like country roads 
Yeah, country girls are like country roads The best ones have got curves The best ones got The best ones have got curves The best ones have got curves We're back here with uh, Jason Clark and Matt Barfield. You just heard their uh, new song, Mercy Shine's new uh, single, Curves. Uh, guys, uh, it, is the rest of the EP as, as fun and upbeat as that, or is it kind of varied as far as what the material is like? It's really fun and upbeat, in my opinion. Um, I think Sledgehammer is probably the more rocking one on there. Mm-hmm. Um, but, but the whole EP is just, in my opinion, it's just... It's, it's amazing, man. It's got some really great songs on there, and I think people will dig it. Curves I think is- one thing that helps, too, is all five of them are definitely sing-along songs and dance songs. Right. Yeah. I was just about to say that because Curves is one of those songs that it, you hear it once and it kind of gets stuck in your head and in a good way. It's It's got a catchy melody, but it's also got lyrics that you can sing along to, like you just said. So it's perfect, perfect uh, summertime song. Absolutely, man. Uh, it's where, one of those songs where you got to get in your car and crank up the radio as loud as you could go and roll the windows down and just take a drive on an open road somewhere. Yeah, you definitely need to play that one loud. Absolutely. Uh, where can people get their hands on on this? Uh, so we just heard the the new single, but if people want to grab that one and, and the the uh, the entire EP. Uh, where can people find it? The the EP will be dropping in a few weeks, but. We have um, iTunes, Spotify, and they can also go to our social media sites. And our website is www.mercyshine.com. Okay. Mercy Shine is the name to remember. Uh, go find them on online on their social media outlets and on iTunes. Uh, as we just said, you can you can find their music uh, there. Uh, the EP. Does you have a release date for that? Whenever it comes out. Uh, uh, maybe the second, second week in August. Okay, so that's just right around the corner. Uh, Jason and Matt, our guests here from Mercy Shine. Uh, what else have you guys got lined up? Are you are you playing some some shows this summer? You have anything else coming up here in the near future? We have a few shows that we were approached about doing, uh, but currently, right now, we can't say anything because they're not locked in. Okay, but there's some pretty big shows. For us, and we were honored to be to be asked to do the shows. Um, our booking agent is currently booking shows, and we're also trying to get on a tour this year or next year, which would be real nice if we could get on with someone. Sure. Well, hopefully, you guys can get a chance to come out to Oklahoma. We'll uh, we'll keep an eye on that, and uh, whenever you do get a get an Oklahoma date book, then we'll be sure and, and let all of our friends know. Yeah, I'm, I'm ready. You know, I've, I've I've been to Oklahoma before, and I got to say, man, hands down, you people got a beautiful state, man. You should be proud. Well, thank you, thank you very much. We'll come back and and see it again, and and uh, we'll hope to to see you guys here in in the future. Um, again, you can find uh, Mercy Shine on you guys are all over so, social media: Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. People can check out your stuff there? Yes, sir. All right, fantastic. Hey, uh, Jason and Matt, uh, before we let you go, i got a few uh, questions, rapid-fire questions, just just for fun, if you guys are up for it. Yes, sir. That worked. All right, let's do it. Um, first question, first of five questions. Uh, very first concert that you attended, first concert you ever attended. Jason, let's start with you. It was Ozzy Osbourne. Nice. How? What? Uh, what? What year was that? Oh my goodness! You're trying to ask me to remember back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, it's been a minute ago. <laughs> a while back. Um. All right. So yeah, I was, a while back. <laughs> that's. Uh, do you remember how, how old were you? About how old were you when you when you saw Ozzy in your very first concert? Um, I was probably seventeen. Somewhere around 16 or 17. Yeah, wow. So that I had, saw him in 91 on the No More Tears tour. Wow. So that had to be a pretty eye-opening experience for you then. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Matt, what about you? What first concert you ever attended? 
1991 Skinny Puppy on the Two Dark Park Tour. Wow, going old school. Yes, sir, all the way back to Bessie's Boathouse in Norfolk, Virginia, baby. <laughs> <laughs> All right, second question. A uh, song that you wish you had written. Doesn't have to be country. It could be any, anything. Song you wish you had written. Matt, we'll start with you. Uh, anything by Led Zeppelin. <laughs> Even Stairway? Even Stairway, baby. I'll take it all. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what about you, Jason? Song you wish you'd written. I'm going to have to go with anything that Keith Whitley did. Wow, some Keith Whitley then. Nice. Good choice, good yeah. choice. Lots lots of great songs from, from one of the greats. All right. Uh that's that's a that's a pretty broad spectrum there. Led Zeppelin to Keith Whitley. <laughs> we got it all. We got it all covered. All right, third question. Um Jason, most recent film that you saw in a theater? Mm, you got me on that one. Been a while since you've been to the movie theater? Yeah, I'm probably going to have to say one of the Avengers movie with my son. Okay. Matt, what about you? Uh, it. I took my little son to see that one. He wanted to see it, so we uh, we both went to go see it. You're going to go back and see Chapter 2 coming up in, what, September, I think? Uh, we're there, buddy. <laughs> you can bet on that. All right. Uh, quite... I'm going to go see his Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. So there you go. Yeah, that one. I, I haven't got a chance to see that, but it looks good. Uh, question number four. Uh, Matt, we'll start with you. Your go-to fast food restaurant. Taco Bell. The Bell. All right. What about you, Jason? <laughs> Ooh, I don't eat a lot of fast food, but I'm going to have to say... I'm going to have to go with Zaxby's. Zaxby's. Good chicken? Yeah, the chicken's good. I usually get the salad. Salad. Salad's good, too. All right. Matt, uh, jokes, on me all, Matt jokes on me all the time because when we all get together to do a photo shoot or when we record it or any time we get together to do something, mm -hmm. it's like you're always eating a salad. <laughs> so, you, <laughs> so you're the diva of the, of the group, then? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I try to eat healthy. There you go. Let's, let's word it that way. That's good. Yes, <laughs> nothing wrong with that. We shouldn't. We shouldn't give you a hard time for that. All right. Last question, guys. Uh, for either one of you, uh, what do country girls and country roads have in common? They both got curves, baby. <laughs> Curves is the new single from Mercy Shine. Check it out. Go to iTunes. Uh, you can also find them on uh, social media. And I uh, hope to see uh, more from you guys in the future. Jason Clark and Matt Barfield, thanks so much for uh, spending some time with us today. Hey, thank you. You're welcome, and thank you for your time. It's, a, it's an honor and a pleasure.